It was loud in Assembly Hall as the Indiana Hoosiers had a dominant day beating Michigan State 82 to 69. Audrey Marr for the Hoosier Network. It was a statement win that it seems Indiana needed with many players stepping up for the Hoosiers. You know, we've had our ups and downs in terms of guys stepping up, but these last three games, man, everybody that's played has, you know, played a, a major, major role in us, us winning. And it's not just Trace. Yeah, Trace is kind of the guy that's driving the car, but the supporting cast is really Stepping up for Indiana was Tamar Bates and Trey Galloway. Both ended the day with 17 points and combined for 8 of 9 shooting from beyond the arc. Work before the season got the duo ready for when their time came. Just running that second unit this fall really helped me out um, to get me ready for the season. I mean, it, was, it was really hard going against Jalen and um, Xavier in the fall. It made me a lot better. Trace Jackson Davis raised the roof today, contributing to the win as he earned his 40th career double-double. In his second 30-point game in a row, he marked it with several high-profile slams and showcased his confidence afterwards. I thought I missed a few bunnies early, and um, they were kind of sitting, and then, but we were moving the ball around, and they were hitting shots, and then it kind of, in the second half, it spaced the floor and allowed me to go one-on-one. -on -one, uh, I feel like there's not a person in the country that can honestly guard me. So. Indiana began their Big Ten stretch losing their first three games, but they've now won three in a row and are 4-4 four and four in conference play. Indiana will continue their Big Ten play and travel to Minnesota on Wednesday for a 9 p.m. matchup. For the Hoosier Network, I'm Audrey Marr.